Hello and welcome on Thomas Geiger car. Today with the new Porsche 718 Cayman T and 718 Boxster T. The latest addition to the entry-level sports car out of Stuttgart. The T for touring promises more fun to drive, a more engaged drive and a sportier setup. If you want to know if that's true and what to expect from the vehicle that will be on the market in Europe already this spring, join me on my first test drive and I'll tell you more about it. The T models of Boxster and Cayman are driven by the same four-cylinder turbocharged engine that we know from the standard Boxster and Cayman. Two liters of displacement, 300 horsepower, 385 newton meters of torque. Also the driving figures are the same. 0 to 100, 5.1 seconds, top speed 275 kilometers. But the feeling is totally different. The car is rougher, more engaged, it sits two centimeters lower on the road, suspension is stiffer and with the diff lock in the rear axle the car goes around the corners way faster. So it's really a more engaging way of driving, a more Porsche-like feeling even with the standard engine. The biggest changes design-wise you can realize in the interior. We have nice colored bucket seats, we have color matching seat belts, we have the standard sport chrono package that you can realize and recognize on that watch over here. We have a new steering wheel and since Porsche has taken out some weight, we don't have standard door handles, we have these belt-like door handles as we know it from the race cars. So not really big functional changes, but really looking nice gadgets. The design changes for the 718T for touring are only minor. Porsche just has added some gray decoration parts. So mirror housing is gray, the 20 inch wheels are in magnesium gray, the air intake is gray and to show that you have a special car there are stickers saying Cayman 718T for touring at the side and at the back. So if you go ahead of any other car, everybody can see you're not driving a standard Cayman, you're driving the new T model. Thanks for joining me on that first ride with the new touring models of Porsche Cayman and Boxster. The changes are only minor, but very effective. Even if the engines haven't changed at all, the car delivers more fun to drive than ever. A more engaged drive for only a minor surcharge to the base model's price. So if you can't afford the GTS or just want to save some money for other fun, this is the vehicle to go for. Thank you, Shishye, Saitien and bye-bye.